Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, in our loft, we always make the most incredible dishes in the kitchen. But today, Clem has decided he's got a brilliant idea because we're going to be making something from Alaska. He's called it Alaska because <laughs> it's really cold on the inside, crunchy and warm on the outside. Like I'm Alaska. Still, I'm still trying to figure out how that works because it's not like that. Alaska's <laughs> freezing all over the place. So maybe you mean like in an igloo... They make the cold outside and then... I don't know why they called it in Alaska. It's a thing. It's a <laughs> it's thing. A thing. Okay, okay, so what it is, it's a, it's a baked Alaska, which okay. is... All the inspiration comes from the baked Alaska, which is, like I said, it's a big amount of um, ice cream covered in a meringue that gets brulee. Brulee okay. means it gets burnt on the outside. So maybe they make it look like an igloo is maybe what they're going for with it. So let's, let's, you know let's okay, get started. We're making started. an igloo. We're yeah. making an igloo <laughs> on the show today. Okay, so what I've got in this pot over here is some sugar that's just boiling away. Okay. We're going to bring that up to softball stage, which is like 120 degrees Celsius. I'm okay. using a thermometer. You could do the actual test of dipping a little bit in the water, feeling yes, it. Like a soft it goes, ball. Yeah. Hence the name, soft, soft ball stage. stage. There you go. Gotcha. In the bowl, I've got some egg whites. I've already started whipping up, and I've mm -hmm. got some cream of tartar in there. Can I test you? Why do we add the cream of tartar? Because it helps proof it up. It gives air volume and air to the and stabilizes meringue. it. Stabilizing oh, it's a it. Well Obviously, done. that's exactly what it is. You knew that. Hey, you knew <laughs> exactly why that egg of that tartar was in there. Okay. So what I'm doing, the sugar's looking good. So to give that a stir, and I'm going to let the motor so keep on oh, running. Okay. And I'm going to start pouring that in there. What's sure. going to cool? It's going to make a meringue. Type of marshmallowy. Mm. That's, that's why we use the hot sugar. I see. So I'm going to let that go. That sugar cooking smells so delicious. It oh. does. And we keep on going. Incorporate it. It's important that you have the egg whites in a high speed as you pour it in. Because yeah. obviously, if it's not. Keep it fluff, keep it fluff. I was going to solidify and cool too quickly. You're going to have cooked egg in your bowl. So let that keep on going. I'm gonna add, no, that's fine, let it keep on going. So what I'm using, I'm using the magnet today. That's gonna be our ice cream in the center. Oh, that's a good idea, because it's already done for you. Mm. It is, and they belong to the um, Amazonian Society, so they make sure that the beans are ethically sourced, and obviously, they taste amazing when they make yes, the chocolate, you know? Yes, exactly. So that's, for that reason, I've paid a fair trade coffee with as well. Also very sustainable in the source of mm. where it comes mm. from. We've even gone the extra step <laughs> and sourced these amazing cups. But it's also, also recyclable. <laughs> Made for recycled material. You see, expect us to go the extra mile. Extra mile. There yeah. we go. The thing is about Claire, what, what we love to do in the afternoon express loft, obviously, making something super sweet. Did you really feel guilty about eating it? Now what we try and do is we make dishes that are super sweet, but also that make you feel less guilty about it because there's so many other reasons why it's so good for the environment, it's good for all the other reasons. So see what you did there. We're saving the world. You're helping people eat dessert guilt-free. There, I agree, we are. Saving the save the planet one 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 diet at a time. <laughs> I guess. So, so what you would do is you let this go a little bit longer, let it okay. become really fluffy, really glossy. I'm in the real world, in the, the TV world we're going to. Because I want to show you how we actually finish it all up. Cool. So get that in there. Oh. And I'm going to ask you, okay, you've got it ready. You've got all your magnums out. I've got my magnums out. I pre-prep. I'm always organized. You know me in this kitchen. I do not do this thing of winging it like you. I don't what? have that kind of skill. <laughs> I just pre-prep everything and make sure it's all out and ready to go. Cool. So seeing as you're saying I, I don't prep. I mean, isn't pre-prepping prepping anyway? Yeah, basically, you I guess. Prep, you're prep. I, I guess so. Yeah, you, did there, I get it. you started it. <laughs> <laughs> back down, back down, shade. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to ask you to pipe. You can do all of them. Uh -huh. Give it a bit of effect. Stop piping this over the magnums. Sure. Cool. Okay, just like all over them? Yeah, sure, go for it. Oh, it's so nice and fluffy. Light and fluffy. Ooh. Okay, I hope, that, I hope this isn't a design that you're meant to be making. No, you here. go crazy. Do like yeah. you would normally do. I don't know how to design pretty things. That's. Something I'm not good at doing. Okay, I'm going over the sides. Whoops. Okay. So I've got a little tool I'm going to use in the kitchen today. Cool. And it's this guy over here. That looks like my dad's <laughs> drill. Your, your nan or your dad? My dad. Like, Why is your <laughs> nan have <laughs> <laughs> drill? No, no, she definitely doesn't have a drill. Okay, so you could use a blowtorch, right? Um, so <laughs> some people have a blowtorch. Stop it. <laughs> okay, yeah, then blowtorch and we don't, okay? Okay, so if you don't have one, check your dad's garage. <laughs> you might have a heat gun. Okay. If he doesn't, uh, like he's actually just use a flame, just go over it, just to brill it. So it's okay, a little bit your nan's drill. Yeah. It's quite hot. It's like your grand's hair dryer on steroids. I see, it's so really, you, really, yeah, really maybe hot. get a really hot hair dryer. My mom is you just break it slightly and it'll start to heat the outside. Because you don't need such a high temperature. To start um, cooking absolutely yeah. done. But this okay. gets really hot. But it also does it, it cooks the meringue even further a little bit and starts softening the chocolate on the magnet, oh, as you can see. Okay. Well, and I'm going to let you do that because basically all that's need to be done and make it look really, really pretty. So, um, right, that's all that needs to be done. That's it. Fantasmic. So, you guys want to go and get the recipe and the shopping list for all the things that we make on Afternoon Express. Our website is a wealth of knowledge. There's full of recipes, full of shopping lists you can go and find there for yourself. It's afternoonexpress.co.za.
A warm welcome back to Afternoon Express, but I should say a slightly chilly welcome back to Afternoon Express because buy an M Collection Magnum and win glamorous prizes. You can find one of 500,000 keys engraved on your ice cream stick and stand a chance to win designer prizes from the M Collection by Gert Johan Kutsia and or a shopping spree worth 100 thousand rand at Santon City. All you have to do is SMS the unique code found on the key to 37690. Those SMSs cost one rand fifty. T's and C's do apply and can be found uh, on pleasure.mymagnum.co.za. Remember the competition closes on the 30th of June 2016. So I've still got a bit of time to enter the competition. I'm going to choose a white almond because I think it describes me. It's white and nutty. So it's me. Okay, let's see how this works out. Let's hope I get a key. Push this one. Oops. <laughs> Just breaking my chocolate. I'm too excited to see. Too excited to see. Oh, no, it's lame. No key, no key, no key. So I don't get to enter the competition, but it's still yummy. Mm. Mm. Super delicious. Clem, let's go take the rest of them through sure to the thing. lounge. Mm -hmm. I can't Magnum cope ever. with how you open an ice cream. Mm. <laughs> like that, uh, that actually gives me anxiety. I wanted to go there and open it for you. <laughs> I'm a boy. I was just like... Mm. <laughs> Plus, ripping them open to make it look TV cool is hard. It does look delicious, though. So what have you made us? What have you made in Alaska? It's, it's called you. in Alaska. Okay. Basically, it's an ice cream stick that you got. You got Magnum ice cream on the inside, and we've put a meringue, a coffee meringue, on top of it, and we've burnt it with a torch thing, which made it like brown oh, on the outside. There we go. <laughs> I was going like to fight you right. for this one. Just call it an Alaska. Right. <laughs> well, that's the one that Clem did, so it obviously looks a little bit better. I got the one that Danilo <laughs> looks. It looks a bit. Well. <laughs> How are you doing, YouTube fam? Thank you so much for watching, sharing, and commenting. We love hearing from you, so be sure to keep up to date with all things Afternoon Express by clicking the subscribe button right here.